Okay guys, look what I just came across. I also found bamboo and cocoa beans while running around in this jungle. And hello, those for you that don't know, I am Dee Dee and welcome to Dee Dee's World. Last time we left off, we had just found this jungle pyramid. And this generated really weird because the opening should have been on this side, like right here. And, um, since it's a generated so weirdly, we are actually coming in from the top. And I do have torches, so we'll light things up here as we go. Because I know how YouTube likes to make everything dark. And my inventory is still full from last video. Because I am pre-recording this. It is actually middle of the week for me and this week is going to be crazy so I'm kind of pre-recording a little bit. Ha ha! You didn't get me with either one. Gold, gold, Bones, bamboo, I'll take that. I don't have room for the gold. Three arrows in that one. And seven in that one. So I'm not going to worry about the arrows so much. Although, since it's I already have an arrow slot. I might as well. I would love to take the dispensers and stuff, but, and under normal circumstances, I would. However, I don't have the room. So I'm not. And iron, I will take. Thank you. And that's all that rope. And we'll go up here. And we'll get out of here. And it's turning night, wouldn't you know? Let's sleep on the go. There we go. Now, let's get out of here. It looks like it could be a deep dark hole. But I don't have the inventory space. But I wanted to go through the jungle temple with you guys before I headed back to base. And there's some more cocoa beans. I have been finding them. Oh yeah, another thing I found was melon. As you can tell. I have found a lot of stuff in this jungle. Now we're going to put our boat in the water and we're going to go see about finding this buried treasure. And we're going to put that there, put the boat in the water, um, put our map in our hand that we found in the last episode. And we are nowhere near close to this. We are a tiny little speck. Ow. Look what I see, guys. 
I don't want to go right over the top of that. You see it? It looks like there's a lot of drowns around though. There's another one down there. Give me my sharpness five sword. Not even out of the boat and I'm hearing drowns. And seeing drowns. Is it really worth it, guys? Is it really worth it? Ooh, that one's got a trident. Give me a trident, mister. So much for my boat, guys. I want this Nautilus shell, though. You guys can have that back. I don't want that. I wanted my boat. Oh, no. This is not good. And they're all following me, too. <laughs> I am going to have to swim over to this island over here and make a new boat. Because there's no way of getting my boat back. I'm not going to deal with those uh, drowns. I would much rather survive. I've died enough already in this series. Now that I'm up here on land, let's make a crafting table. Um, I'll chuck the torches on the ground for right now. And then we will make a boat. Chuck the torches back on the ground. And we will eat. And we will head out again. And let's take a look at this map. Let's see. We need to head 
northeast of where we are. So we need to go northeast that direction. So we will steer clear of them guys and we will head towards this buried treasure. And apparently you can't eat and boat at the same time. Just like you can't eat and look at a map at the same time. Okay, okay, let's find this buried treasure. When I get a little closer, guys, I'll bring y'all back. Because right now, it looks like I'm a long way away. Well, guys, I haven't gone very far. And look what I found. And we are starting to get somewhat close it might be these islands up here like right up here Might be this one here. Somewhere on this island. And it's turning night as well. Okay, I was watching a video by um, Pixarus. And he gave a little hint as to how to find these chests a little easier because I usually have problems. So I'm going to tell you all how to do it. If you look at your chunks, usually it's the one in the chunk. You want to look at your map, but it's usually the chunk that's got nine, nine nine as a rule right here this one right here and let's find out if it works nope not this time But honestly, it looks like it's right here. I don't get it. Okay. Pixel Riss's idea didn't work. Now, if we look at the map, I 
again. It would be like right here by the looks of things. I don't understand. Where is this chest? Holy moly. My poor shovel's gonna break. And all, well, all it has on it is efficiency too. So, well, there it went. Well, I might as well gather up the sand now. Nothing like a stack of sand. Now we got the diamond shovel. I don't get this. Where to blaze this. Ooh. Nope, it's not there. I thought I saw it, but I don't get it. Where is this map? Does anybody else have this much trouble finding treasure tests? Because I sure am. Hmm. All right. It should be right here. I have dug all the way around this. I don't understand. Where could it be? I'm about ready to give up, guys. And wow, this is really close to that monument. Really close to that monument. What can I get rid of that I do not really need? I guess I could get rid of these because I already have tons of tons of carrots at home. I just could really use the sand right now. I don't understand this. Where can this chest be? I mean, look at the crater we made. And right over there is the Ocean Monument. 
Or no. I take back. It's over there. Right there. I would go closer, but I'm scared too, guys. I don't want mining fatigue if I'm going to be trying to find this darn, um, chests that I can't find. Alright, let's take a look at this map one more time. Should be right in here. Hmm. Totally beyond me, guys. Totally beyond me. Okay, well, I'm gonna dig it up. I'll stay here and dig until... I get so frustrated I can't stand it no more. And if I find it, I'll bring you guys back right here. If not, I'll bring you guys back at the base. Okay, guys, I have made a crater. I have not found that chest. So I am heading back home. I will meet you guys there. Okay guys, finally got back. And even though we really didn't do a whole lot in the project book today, but did a lot of exploring, we do have the comment question of the day actually from last episode that we weren't able to do. And that comment question of the day comes from Rat Dog. And in the video previous to that, my kitty had gotten on my desk and was in front of my face blocking my computer screen and I couldn't see nothing. And his name is Toby and that's where this comes from. Toby, blocking your view could be catastrophic if it comes at the wrong time. And Rat Dog, you are so, so true. It has actually happened to me. So, therefore, you get the question, comment question of the day. And until next time, guys. If you like the video, please leave me a like. Comment if you want your comment to be in the comment question of the day. And subscribe if you're new. Till next time. This has been Dee Dee. Bye bye for now.